near Pleiku in April, a master control station is being built for the DECA navigational system. DECA is a highly stable all-weather radio position fixing service, which provides aircraft position information from a set of widely spaced radio transmitting stations. When the subsidiary slave stations are constructed, this system will cover the central part of Vietnam from the 17th parallel down to Dulles. Technical personnel are helping to install the new system. The first DECA system became operational in the southern part of Vietnam in January 1963, with stations located at Tansanut, Bung Tau, and three smaller towns. It has assisted greatly in combat assault missions, resupply of units, aircraft recovery, medevac, and other missions. Here, two of the technicians prepare a rough draft of a flight map at Tonsonet Air Base. After studying the rough map, they plot topography detail on the original flight map, which later will be made into printing plates. A technician reproduces copies of the flight log chart, which will be inserted into a display mechanism mounted on the console of the aircraft. Information is furnished to the aircraft up to a distance of several hundred kilometers. This information is either used to position a map or is shown directly on a chart in pictorial form with navigational accuracy of approximately 500 meters. It can help a pilot to find a specific location in unidentifiable terrain. Here, the technical maintenance crews install the DECA system into two UH-1B helicopters on the flight line. Into the console, the technician installs the three phase reading meters, which provide the basic information to the operator. Tech reps work on the installation of the receiver antenna under the helicopter. The flight chart keys, which program the computer chart scale, go into the console. The display holds 20 feet of chart and provides the pictorial presentation to give the operator a constant track of his route. Then the display with its map is mounted in the cockpit. The newly installed equipment is explained to the crew chief. He is shown the computer in its storage compartment and the console with a chart display and keys. The Huey now makes a test flight. The moving flight log chart with its needle marks the helicopter's course. This system will help future operations by providing accurate airlifts and fire delivery from gunships.